The Organized Stylist is a Chicago-based interior design firm that's taking balanced living to the next level. Lead interior designer Sanem D'Angelo joins us now with holiday decor ideas that will engage your senses and create moments. Welcome back. Thank you so much for having me. It's so, so good to be back. So good to be here. I, I love this idea of adding heirloom things to your decor. Yes. I just don't know how to do this. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> so it's so easy to achieve. I really want you to look for those heirloom pieces, sentimental pieces that are on the smaller side. Okay. okay. Because I want you to display them on places like the console table, a bookshelf, or even the coffee table. Okay. So you're going to display it in a glass shadow box okay. so that oh. it could be seen. I mean, see, look at like this perfect example. Those are actually my grandfather's track and volleyball medals. Oh, that's so, so cute. cute. Right? And so you're going to display it on these flat surfaces. And you guys just wait till you see the attention that those attract mm -hmm. once family and friends come over. The stories. And it's that moment that evokes the emotion, and that's what makes it feel so festive. Mm -hmm. And, and you don't, back those memories. You don't have to make it Christmassy to make it fit, right? Absolutely okay. not. It's those moments and that con connectivity between like that heirloom piece and that sentimental piece in the people mm -hmm. who make it festive. I love okay, that. Okay, but there are ways to incorporate it into your Christmas decorations, like with your ornaments, wouldn't you say? Yes, for sure. So I really want you to pull inspiration from your home. Okay. So I don't want you to think, um, Christmas colors have to be your typical red and green. Okay. So think of the color scheme that's already in your house and think of objects that really bring you joy. So if you love flowers, you can incorporate flowers into your Christmas tree. Oh. Right? Yeah. Okay. If you like metallics, you can the incorporate the tinsel or um, garland that's metallic in bronze or gold or even silver. Okay. And yeah, you don't, I don't want you to think your ornaments have to be your typical glass spheres. I saw ribbons are a big thing on TikTok ribbons right now. Ribbons are huge. Okay. Bells are a really big thing too. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And, but the metallics are there as well. Mm -hmm. How about light? That always oh, sets gross. a mood as far as I'm concerned. I mean, obsessed with light. Okay. I'm typically a minimalist, but when it comes to battery operated candles, maximalist. Okay. I want you to take all the candles, different heights, different sizes, and put them on top of the mantle. See, on the no. console table. How and do it you creates do that. I can't do that. Like there's no Oh, they, in this, look at your it, mantle, beautiful. you had them up there and there's like kind yes. of no rhyme and reason, but a ton of rhyme and reason. And I don't see you know that what? visually. Don't overthink it. I okay. truly want you to just take it, plug and play, and just put the candles all throughout okay. the space, the flat uh -huh. surface, uh -huh. and that glow and that glisten really elevates your space and makes it special. It what so about pretty. changing like the light, the intensity? Oh, yeah, yeah the... so dimmers, Rock. that's yeah, a huge yeah, thing Rock during these yep. times because you can have different light sources at different temperatures that really help create the mood. What about different colors too? Oh yeah, 100%. You can do, you can do different color lighting, but the battery operated lamps is another lighting source that oh, I'm obsessed yeah. with. Because yes. think about it, it's not stationary, it's yeah. mobile. Mm -hmm. You can really, you know, one night put it on the dining room table if you're having wine and charcuterie with friends. Uh -huh. Or then, you know, pick it up and bring it into the living room and put it on top of the coffee table okay. and let it like illuminate your decor on the coffee table. And you table. can change, a lot of those you can change colors too, right? Oh yeah, same with that too. Uh, yeah, there's yeah. different settings. It's mm -hmm. like the elf on the shelf, it's moving around the room. <laughs> <laughs> use wrapping paper to, for decor. Oh yes, I did. So yeah, you can really customize your level of personalization. So I love taking high quality wrapping paper and you know, take out a few pictures in your gallery wall okay. or your picture displays and you can incorporate a festive theme with your wrapping paper. Like use it as a background? No, like truly pop out a picture uh -huh. and you can replace the picture with wrapping oh. paper. Oh. And okay. a pro tip, I love the, um, like a thicker rifle wrapping paper. Like you the can find them. Stuff? Yeah, you can okay. even get a textured paper. Okay. So there's really, uh, wrapping sheets are great too, and it's less waste. Okay. They come in certain size sheets. Mm -hmm. So um, you can cut those up and put them in your frame. I mean, and it doesn't necessarily have to be like Christmas theme, like Nutcracker or right. Christmas Holly. I mean, if you find wrapping paper with uh, croissants and cinnamon rolls and you love carbs, then you put that <laughs> in and you, you are personalizing your look. And you've instantly added some character and some charm to the yeah. room. Oh my gosh, too. ladies, 100%, yes, What's absolutely. What's your favorite thing this year, Christmas decoration wise? Do you have like a go-to other than the candles? Oh gosh, right. I mean, 
that battery operated yeah, lamp yeah. is a huge thing for me. Okay. I love how you can move it around the house, but textured textiles is oh, also huge. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, like pillows. Yeah, and pillows and blankets. and blankets. Think velvet, crushed velvet, oh, chenille, yes. or even full fur. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And pro tip, if you're going to buy pillowcases that are holiday themed, whether it's you know holiday themed or with the textile texture, yep. take an inventory of your pillow insert sizes and just buy a pillow cover because at the end of the holiday season, the it's so much easier to store a pillow cover than a pillow yeah, insert. That's yeah. a good idea. True. So mm -hmm. now, thank you so much. These are oh great my gosh, tips. Thanks so much for having me. TheOrganizedStylist.com is where you can get some more info or just call her and have her do it for you. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's, what, that's what I would that do. That would be too. All right.